Alright. This video is about adding and subtracting whole numbers. And uh, let me go ahead and scroll down here. This video is going to cover these vocabulary words. Uh, we're going to be covering addition, put together, and um, you can see the vocabulary words right there. So go ahead and pause the video so you can copy this down in your IMN. Here's our action poster. You've probably seen these in the past, so this shouldn't be new to you. We'll be using these action posters to guide us in our strategy part. So here is our problem. Move that around. I guess down to there. All right. So Hallmark Elementary School has 1,032 students. Emerson Elementary School has 1,189 students. And I want to know what is the total number of students at the two schools. So first, let's take a look and decide what the, what is the problem asking for. And the, what the problem is asking for is the total number of students at the two schools. All right now, we need to draw a picture. So Hallmark, Hallmark Elementary School, excuse me, has 1,032 students. So let me draw a rectangle here. I'm going to label it 1,000. 32. Okay. And Emerson Elementary has 1,189. So if I do this, 1,189 students. Hmm. That doesn't look right. We need to adjust Emerson's unit bar because it has more students than Hallmark. And right now, it's showing you that it's the same. So let's, uh, let's go ahead and extend it out just a little bit, just to show that Emerson is actually bigger. So what are we looking for? All right, the total. So I'm going to combine these two together. All right, let's move on to strategy. So looking at the main idea, this problem looks like it's going to go with the put together action poster. And here we'll show the put together action poster. This one right there. The put together action poster. If you notice, the detail section supports this because it's showing us joining the two together. So let me note, we wouldn't use the multiplication put together action poster because we're not putting together equal groups. Because our groups are unequal, we use addition. So we're going to make an equation. So look in your IMN where you wrote the definition, if you need help remembering. But we're going to write an equation to find the total number of students at the two schools. So the number of students at Emerson, I'm sorry, at Hallmark, plus the number of students at Emerson equals the total number of students. And that T right there, that T right there is to show um, the total. Now, what I should have done, it's actually, I'm going to take this number right here, and I'm going to line up my place value, so that way I can add them together like that. It makes it a little bit easier. So now we solve our problem. So 2 plus 9 is 11. Uh, that would be 12. That's 2. And that's 2. So our total is 2,221. So finally, we need to explain how we got our answer. I found the sum of 1,032 and 1,189 to find the total number of students at the two schools. That's a pretty good explanation of how we did it. So hopefully seeing how to work one of these problems uh, how to work one of these problems out has helped you. If you have any questions, don't forget to put it on your WSQ on your WISC so I can help you.